Good afternoon, folks, or whenever it is that you are watching. Uh, I'm back with a, a quick little installment here. Um, make sure that you hit the like, the subscribe. Um, got some nice uh, <laughs> four people viewed the uh, Snowpiercer recap. So we're getting there. We're doing big things. Um, you know, that featured another person, and this is just me, so maybe that's interesting. But, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's take it away. So, um... You know, obviously, one of the big stories this week is uh, Stop Asian Hate here in America. Um, there was a shooting uh, at a massage parlor, and um, I'm definitely not condoning that. But, um, <laughs> never go, I'm definitely not condoning that, and then followed up with but, because that's just, that's just going to lead to bad things. I'm not condoning that. No, on an entirely separate thing, um, <clears throat> I just got me started to think about uh, race and... Um, you know, all the rest of it. And, it, you know, it's one of those interesting things because, you know, when you see an Asian person, you know that they're Asian. If you see an Indian person, you know they're Indian. If you see an African-American person, sorry, if you see a black person, you know that they're black. Um, even a small amount of it, you know, you could be, whatever, 25%, you know, and, you know, you get classified as black, all the rest of it. One of those things that happens to me all the time is... Um, you know, I, I am Jewish, and people come up to me and it's like, wow, oh, man, like, I would never guess that you were Jewish. Like, you know, you don't look Jewish. Now, that's the most confusing thing for me, because, like, you know, the basis of our, our religion is, like, two different sects. There's Ashkenazi and there's Sephardic. Now, like, <laughs> those are the most Jewish, especially Ashkenazi. That is the most Jewish-sounding word that you could possibly have in the entire world. Right, so, and that that's two different races, so, you know, that doesn't make any sense to me, so, like, it's not a race, but, like, somehow, over the course of thing, uh, Judaism is the only one that, like, when you introduce yourselves, like, nobody goes, hi, I'm Polish, I'm German, I'm Irish, and I'm Catholic, nobody says, you know, I'm Indian, and I'm Hindu, nobody says, I'm Arabic, and I, like, you know, and I'm Muslim, although, like, we just expect that, but, you know, people, like, all the time when I'm introducing myself to people, and they say, oh, like, you know, where are you from, or whatever, you know, where's your family from, I say, you know, I'm British, German, Polish, and then, like, the fucking peanut gallery behind me goes, and you're Jewish, too, but, like, that doesn't mean anything, that's not my heritage, that, that is the religion, but no other religions are forced to, um, say what they are, but also, I've never understood, like, what's the defining characteristic of a Jewish person? Because, like, if you say that you don't look Jewish, then there must be something. And I think it's, like, the only um, religion <laughs> that is based off of, like, the most Jew like the most conservative of all of them. So, like, you see some Hasidic people with the curls and, and everything, and, like, that's not what a Jewish person looks like. Like, that's just what the Hasidic Jewish people look like. Um, and you shouldn't expect somebody like me uh, to actually look like them. But, you know, like, big nose, like, you could also be Italian. Like, we all know that they got n nice, massive schnoz. Um, really, like, our only defining characteristics come from, you know, being rich and being cheap. Like, it, you know, it's things that you, you can't see. And, like, how do I come off as looking not cheap? Um, I mean, I guess you could wear nice clothes, but, like, you know, <laughs> didn't do it. And how do I come off looking not rich? I guess you could not wear rich clothes, like, I mean, but then I'll be looking cheap, so it's, like, kind of a catch-22. So I'm not exactly sure how it is that I, I, I can come off as not looking Jewish. Um, maybe it's the massive five then. All five of them. The lack of hair. Um, so th that's one of those confusing things. Everybody else you can properly define, and you can look at, and you can say, you're definitely this, you're definitely that. Um, if you've got, uh, blonde hair and blue eyes, but don't necessarily think that you want to kill me. Um... You know, it's just, I, I've just always been a little bit confused by that. And if somebody could honestly tell me, um, you know, how that works, I'd, I'd, I'd be more than happy. But I've met a black Jew in my life. You know, I've met an Asian Jew in my life. So explain to me how I don't look Jewish. Thank you all. Hit that like, hit that subscribe. Thank you for taking some time to watch this video. Bye.